Now, the number of COVID-19 cases confirmed here in South Korea has been surging by the day as health officials here focus on a church. It's confirmed more than 100 new cases alone today, bringing the country's total to more than 200. Now, most of the new cases have been linked to a church in Tegu. For more, we have our Choi Jong-yoon reporting from the National Medical Center. So, jong yoon where are these latest cases coming from? Hi guys, I'm out here at the National Medical Center, one of the facilities designated for exclusively treating COVID-19. We just have an update. We have 208 confirmed cases in South Korea, but four additional cases are not known, uh, which uh, are not yet known which they came from. Uh, but as of 6 p.m. today, 83 out of 100 newly confirmed cases come from the southeastern city of Daegu and surrounding Gyeongsangbuk-do province, bringing the total number of cases in the country to 204. The region alone with 153 confirmed cases so far accounts for more than 70 percent of the total nationwide. Other regions have also reported new cases, five in Seoul, four in Gyeongsangnam-do province, and one each in the provinces of Chungcheongnam-do, Chungcheongbuk-do, Gyeonggi-do, and Jeollabuk-do, and the cities of Gwangju and Jeju. South Korea's first death was reported on Thursday. That was a 63-year-old man who had been hospitalized with schizophrenia in Cheongdo Denam Hospital for more than 20 years. On Wednesday, he died of pneumonia, but through an autopsy, doctors found out that he, he was positive for the COVID-19. Right, Cheong Yoon, this is causing a lot of concern in Tegu especially. Why is it spreading so fast in these particular places, and what kind of measures are being taken uh, in the region? Among the newly confirmed cases, more than 90 are tied to the Shincheonji Church of Jesus, which in Daegu was visited by the nation's 31st patient. But the number of cases is likely to surge as some 500 worshippers at the church are claiming they have symptoms of the coronavirus. Now that community-based transmission is occurring in Daegu, the government has put the area under special quarantine. The city government has enhanced its quarantine regime by designating more hospitals for treating the virus and is providing masks and medical supplies. It's also postponing all large gatherings and events until March. On top of that, all daycare, daycare centers in Daegu are cancelled until further notice. Back to you guys. Our Choi Jong-un reporting live from the National uh, Medical Care there, Center there.